Hi guys! Welcome to another vlog. Today is the very first episode of my solo diaries. What that means is I am going to go places on my own, which I feel like is very difficult for me. I love being on my own at home, but as soon as I go out in public, I have more of a need to be with my friends or family because otherwise, you know, I feel like when you're alone in public, people look at you or stare at you and they would say, oh, look at her, she's all alone, she has no friends. It's probably wrong of me to think that. I used to think that a lot when I was younger, like, oh no, she doesn't have friends, she's doing this on her own. But honestly, right now, I think it's powerful to do things on your own, like, you can do your own stuff, you don't need people to do it. Well, today, I'm going to a concert and it is Role Model. He's not so well known here and he is not coming to Belgium so I had to go to the Netherlands, Utrecht to be exact. And for example for this concert like role model is not so very well known. I don't think anybody of my friends know him. So I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna go alone. It's not even the first time I went to a concert alone. I also went to Olivia Rodrigo back in May on my own because I wanted to go VIP and oh my god, wow. What an experience. I was at the barricade, like, wow. When I was waiting in line, I met two Americans and they were so much fun and I ended up joining them. And then we met some other Americans and you make friends, you know, when you're on your own. Sometimes you just have to be social or you just like pick up on the vibes of people. Like, I just absolutely love going there on my own. So today we are going to try to do the same thing. So I'm not as scared to go alone to a concert because I've already done it. But I'm like in this in this solo diary series, I'm gonna do stuff like going to the movies alone. Never done that in my life, but I want to. Going for lunch on your own, lunch or dinner. Dinner is more scary though. Lunch is pretty acceptable, I think. And then maybe go grab a coffee. I don't know. Guys, if you have any suggestions of things I can do on my own, please leave them in the comment section. I would love to hear some ideas. I have a few lined up, so I'm definitely going to do those. Uh, but yeah, I think it's, it's kind of scary. And I like going out of my comfort zone because it makes you grow as a person, I feel like, and you learn new stuff and you get to know new people. So I'm kind of excited. I just have to put my makeup on. Unfortunately, this little guy decided to pay a visit. It is my first day of my period and he paid a visit, I think, yesterday he was there and he hurt like hell. Like, do you also get like some pimples are just like so crazy painful when they're coming out? Like, what the hell? Like, a pimple doesn't, isn't supposed to hurt, you know? <laughs> I named him Dirk because he's a jerk for coming yesterday when I have a concert today, so not funny. And it kind of rhymes with jerk, so dirk jerk. This concealer is like magic. If you guys want to know what products I use to do my makeup, let me know. So maybe I can make a get ready with me video next time. Ta-da! I am done with my makeup. Nothing to extravagant, just normal simple makeup, just how I like it. And we're gonna finish up with some Sol de Janeiro to smell delicious. I always have very dry skin, so... And this is amazing and smells absolutely delicious. There we go! Now let's figure out what we're gonna do with my hair. Okay, I figured it out. I tried to style my hair a little bit. I didn't do too much. I just like bit my curtain bangs and sprayed some styling spray and then I bit my lips in red, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. My hair is still not 100% dried, but it'll have to dry in a car because I do not have time anymore. <laughs> and this is my fit. These cute pants and then this top, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. And I'm ready. Let's go guys. I am so ready for this concert. Like, oh, my hair is still not working with me. Although I style, try to style it. It's just so difficult with short hair, you know. I'll try to get some volume over here. We are gonna go because it's a long drive. So let's go. Okay, we are going to leave. Just have to put on a GPS. 
Okay, one hour and 50 minutes right now. Let's go! back from the concert my god this was so good my god i don't even have a voice anymore from the shouting like <laughs> what is this oh i finally made it to the car thank god my back is killing me and i am famished like i haven't eaten anything since lunchtime and it's now almost 11 p.m so i'm crazy hungry but i think i'm gonna just stop along the way and just grab something at the gas station i think but 
Guys, we got some merch. Unfortunately, they didn't have a poster. Like, why? But I got this very, very cute t-shirt. Fangirl, I mean, I'm obsessed. The smallest size they had was a large because they sold out of all the other ones. But it doesn't look that, that huge actually. Well, I think the small tee would have been cute or like it would, would have been a crop tee situation. But, um, you know, we're taking what we're getting. And I also got this cute keychain because why not? Like my keychain is so boring and I have been dying to spice it up a little. And this is actually the cutest little keychain I've ever seen. It's like the heels from The Wizard of Oz, clicking your heels three times. That's a hard sentence to say. Clicking your heels three times. Okay, now I got it right. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna go the long way home. It's gonna be another two hour drive. I assume, well, I hope there's no traffic this time because I was in a pretty bad traffic jam. Like when I was on my way here, it was crazy. I think we had traffic for about 30 minutes. There we go, we're on our way. My God, I had so much fun. Tucker is so funny and like, I don't know if he's doing it on purpose or he's, he's just like that, but he's so fun and casual. What am I doing here? Don't come here with a big car because you can't maneuver here. What the hell is this? Okay, now we have to go out. I think it's this way. Yes, it's this way. Um, let's see. I thought it wasn't gonna work. Thank God. <laughs> We're out of the parking lot. Those people are struggling too. I wanted to enter the parking lot and I just couldn't because the door wouldn't open, but I just slipped through when a car came out. So and people over there are having the same kind of problem. Okay, well, I have to put on my GPS. Where's my phone? Crap, where's my phone? Oh, here. Never mind. The long way home. One hour and 13 minutes. Not bad, not bad at all. I will be home at 12. Okay, great. Because I have work tomorrow. I have to get up at seven, which I'm not like very happy about. But you know, that's life. And it, this concert was totally worth it. Like I absolutely, this one is probably has to be in a top three. Let me think. I'm gonna just say my top one is definitely Coldplay Live. They are amazing and they put on a whole show and there's lots of fireworks. Role Model is third place and Code and Grey is second place. Maybe I should make a top five, but that's difficult because I have so many other concerts coming up. I'm gonna try and focus right now on the road because I am babbling here and I'm supposed to focus on the road, which is not very safe. It's green. I have to go. Oh my god, we finally made it home. It's pouring outside. Why is the focus off? Oh, okay. <laughs> I finally made it home. My god, it's almost half past 12. And I'm so tired. Oh my god. It's pouring outside. Like, it's, it's crazy. Like, I don't want to go. I just want to wait for a moment. <laughs> Honestly, today, like, going alone to the concert was so much fun. I didn't really talk to people. I just, like, answered some things here and there. Like, you know, some chit chat. But I, w I wasn't really, like, talking, talking with people. And I didn't mind, actually. I was just enjoying myself. This was actually a success. Probably because I've already been to a concert alone. So it's not as scary. What I I am scared of is like filming myself in public and talking when I'm with my friends I don't really mind because we're just in our own world and we're just talking to each other and filming it but when I'm alone I just I'm scared of filming so actually I didn't film anything of myself when I was waiting or when I was standing in line like that's something we have to work on too but we'll 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 get there all right guys I know it's very dark here and probably not such a great ending to a vlog but I have to be quiet when I go upstairs because everybody is sleeping and I have to be quiet so I can't really film anymore I hope you guys like this video and please like and subscribe and well I will see you on the next episode of solo diaries bye bye